Welcome, welcome, my beautiful Capricorns, my beautiful achievers. I'm Brenda, Brenda Tarot, and I'm here again today to bring you your general tarot and oracle card forecast for the week of February the 1st to the 7th. 2021. I truly again want to thank you for your interest in my channel and for viewing, liking, sharing, and especially subscribing. Always be sure to click that bell button on that option and make that bell ring and you'll get notified immediately when any of my card readings are out here for you to view. As I said, this is a general reading and if you desire a private reading with me, all that information is posted below this video, my prices and how to contact me via my email or my website. Okay, let's get on with our reading. We start off with an absolutely all over energy card and it's beautiful, the wheel. And this is known as the wheel of fortune. So the wheel of fortune generally speaks about a brand new start. Delays are gonna be over, you're moving forward, you're being propelled in a direction forward now. And it's indicative of a change of luck. And given its astrological association with the planet Jupiter, it's usually a change for the good. And you're going to notice synchronicities now. You're going to notice, <clears throat> excuse me, old blocks that are going to be lifted now as well. So these are all great things. You're going to see momentum pick up so that any delays that you've been experiencing are going to end. This is a card that says you're moving towards your dreams now. So try to surround yourself with, and hang out with people who are positive and happy and who also share your dreams and reality like you. So there's some amazing new opportunities coming into some of you Capricorn and you're going to see progress moving forward. Keep that element of positive thinking within yourself. This is the balancing of karma. Now, some of you may even be purchasing or thinking of getting a new vehicle. This is also a wheel which could refer to travel. Now, moving along, let's see what we have for our first energy card. And you've got Uncharted Sea. Excellent card. And this is all about the energy carrying you uh, into something unknown, okay? You're traveling, you're moving in a new part of your journey. You're leaving your comfort zone, maybe. Some of you are heading out towards something new. Whatever it is, keep moving forward. This is embarking you on a brand new part of your life in uncharted waters, basically. And it gives you the chance to move forward, learn something new, do something new. Be a path maker, okay? Be a pioneer here. You're in an amazing place right now. This card represents, and the, the Wheel of Fortune means you're going forward. You're being propelled into a brand new, beautiful, prosperous direction. You've got one ring circus. We've all heard that term before, right? So this is about <clears throat> you going out there independently being able to have the resources at your fingertips to do what it is that you want to do now, okay? Consider, you know, creating and maintaining clear boundaries between you and maybe somebody else as well. You might have had to step back from somebody. And know that you're at a point right now that you can achieve anything if you put your mind to it, okay? You're capable and you're comp competent now. So recognize all, you know, that all the wisdom you've acquired along the way makes you particularly competent and capable of moving forward, okay, with self-reliance. So this is a card that says you are going places. You are moving forward, my beautiful Capricorns. In the next near future, you're going to see prosperity coming into you. Now, it doesn't get much better. You've got the Ten of Pentacles for your crowning energy here in the tarot cards. And this is saying this is happiness. This is fulfillment. This is success in beautiful areas of your life, home life, relationships, and financial stability. So let's, you know, let's take that here with these, the, these beautiful energy cards and they tie in. Now you've got truth be told with your final energy card here. And this is about you maintaining your integrity, you standing in your power of honesty. And also you're going to be you're going to be tested this week to look at things at face value and come out of any denial that maybe you've been avoiding something okay uh, and and be and be willing to be transparent and there's going to be clarity of communication coming into you okay the truth is going to be shown here something's going to be coming out here that you need to see okay so this is not a time for debate about which is true who is true or who is truer okay this is a time when you are called to proclaim your truth, 
right? And do it out loud. Stand up. Be yourself, okay? <clears throat> be your authentic, glorious, flawed self. That's what you need to be this week. Beautiful, beautiful. So, you know what? If you want to be an artist, be an artist. If you want to be a healer, be a healer. If you want to be a writer, be a writer. Do what's true to you. Okay, you might be thinking about wanting to do something. Do it. Don't be afraid to do it. Those were just theoretical, you know, examples I was giving you. But this is basically about you stepping up, going out here and doing something new. You're on a new journey here. And if it's your passion, go for it. Because the Wheel of Fortune says you're about to propel yourself in a brand new direction, which is leading you to your desire of prosperity. Fabulous. <clears throat> Now you've got the beautiful Ace of Cups and Aces are the beginnings of all things exciting. And this particular one could be the beginning of a love affair, something you're going to fall in love with, somebody being drawn to another person, but feeling that wonderful feeling of coming together in partnership. Some of you, it could be a new relationship, a new love, a new romance coming into you. Beautiful. You've got the emperor and you're going to step up and take control of something here. This is you being a leader, uh, stepping up and not being afraid to take the bull by the horns and go after what it is you want. The emperor, he's a leader. He goes up, you know, this could also be somebody in, you know, in leadership that you know uh, that you may be leaning into or dealing with as well. But I see this usually when it shows up as you stepping up, doing something solo independent. And I think it could be something brand new, but you have have all the resources at your fingertips to stay calm and stand in the power of your leadership. He's, you know, look at him sitting there. He's calm. He's got the winning chess piece in his hand. He's not worried or concerned. He knows what it is he wants and he's focused. He's going for it. Now you have the four of pentacles. The four of pentacles is also about you keeping your eyes open to new opportunities, new offers, not being afraid of something that's new. It's also the card of extremes in which you spend your money, save your money, use your energy or not. Uh, so be conscientious this week Capricorn. Where are you spending most of your time and investment into? Is it worthy of you know it staying and stuck in one position if it's not propelling the wheel forward to go towards the prosperity that you want? So this is about keeping your options open. Okay, knowing that there's other resources out there for you to tap into, uh, different opportunities coming in, and you need to see that. Don't be blinded by, uh, you know, oh, how can I put this? Um, you know, they're telling me that, you know, you need to just be more open minded. See the whole picture. Don't turn your back on something because it's something new you've never done. I'm reading this intuitively from my guides as well as the representation of the card. But also don't don't give your all your energy away to uh, everybody else. You can't please everyone at the same time at all times. Okay, so you need to set up boundaries there too. But I think you're holding on to something very tightly. Uh, and it's okay to hold on to your purse strings if you're nervous of losing some money. But be a little more flexible, a little more open-minded when it comes to new opportunities and offers coming into you. And if it has to do with a job offer, then be open-minded to it might be something new you've never done. Don't be afraid. You've got the magician and the magician coming in right above the beautiful Ten of Pentacles says you have the resources. You have everything, all this, all these elements to tap into and now you're able to step up and make the magic happen. So, you know, you could even get some unexpected opportunities or uh, resources coming into you that you didn't expect. But this is your chance now to take yourself where it is you want to go. Okay, you're the wizard, you're the magician, you have the ability to make what you want happen. You have all of those elements. Now, the Eight of Wands shows up and it says your delays are going to be over. If you've been waiting for something to come in, it's going to end. But get ready, ready to hit the ground running because this is a card that says you're going to be so very busy, involved in all kinds of things. Uh, you know, it could be events, it could be, you know, uh, uh, you know, all kinds of things, just many, many things coming into you at this time. Get ready to be, get down and get busy. 
the eight of pentacles beautiful card i love it because it comes in with that ten of pentacles so the crowning energy and this is you getting down to business some of you might be you know trying to perfect your craft uh you might be trying to uh you know take a new course a new form of study adding to your resume uh, maybe some of you are going for your master's or a degree or, or a credit in something so that you can add that to your gifts that you have to offer in your career and you're going to see success coming in beautiful the tower says you're rebuilding it rebuilding a new foundation here something might have changed in your life you know the tower moment comes in it suddenly rocks our world whether it's you know no matter what it's in it could be in a relationship it could be in your career it could be in your home life it could be anything but you are rebuilding a new foundation here okay this is all about moving forward in a progressive and positive direction you don't want to get caught in this position again and maybe whatever you dealt with wasn't built on a firm foundation and it was going to topple down eventually okay we can't build a house on sand okay and we can't build a house over top of a, a water spring and we can't build a house you know right in the middle of a, a of a, a an earthquake fault because eventually it's going to come down so something wasn't built on a firm foundation right off the bat and now you're not going to let that happen again you are rebuilding you are rebuilding a new future here a new foundation another beautiful ace ace of wands this is a card that says keep your eyes open you know to see things that maybe you hadn't thought you would look into this is new opportunities this is excitement this is beautiful these are opportunities coming into you that you need to embrace this is a brand new beginning as aces always are but this is the card that says you know this is your driving motivation here looking at things with vision right being bold go, going towards what it is you want and having belief in your beautiful beautiful abilities here that's what the magician is saying you've got the you've got everything here for you to move forward towards this beautiful beautiful outcome so something's coming in brand new and you know it's not about thinking about what you want it's about you going for it acting on it uh, pushing for what it is that you want and letting everybody know that you mean business okay it's time to trust your own instincts now and go towards the this goal that you are so wanting to go towards now let's see what we can do here with clarification here all right coming in with your center your your crowning energy you have the two of pentacles now this is about maintaining balance here okay so some of you you know you might be working towards your goals here uh, you could also end up with two offers two opportunities two choices and two decisions that you're going to have to make but don't take on more than you can chew okay this is you having to balance things in your life make out that priority list okay tick it off as you go so that you don't overexert yourself when things get really busy here the beautiful card of love and partnership coming in towards you you've got the ace of swords yes finally you see the light finally you see things in clarity when the ace of swords shows up again it means that you're going to be able to move forward stand in your truth and be able to see what it is you truly want moving towards that gorgeous the emperor what have we got with the emperor you have the seven of wands now you may have struggled with something this is a card i call this the wounded warrior pushing through struggling uh, but knowing that at the end of the day you see his wooden st sticks they've got new growth on them he's pro he's he's got this vision and he's not going to give up on it he's a leader okay and this is what you're going to be doing you're going to might have to push forward to prove yourself that you have this ability but don't give up capricorn you have the ability to be your own leader your own boss coming in with the four of pentacles the death card okay so maybe <clears throat> maybe you're going you, you know something's going to end right you're walking away from something but the gift you've got here is this rose that says embrace the new beginning open the next door go through it whatever ended here and it could have been this tower moment that caused something in your life to end now you've got a new beginning a new way to go forward okay move forward and again keep your eyes open keep your mind open this is meant to happen you, you keep your eyes open for the new opportunities coming into you now that something has ended you're the magician and you've got you've got wow have you got all four aces here you've got the wands you've got the swords you've got the pentacles and i thought we had we had another one here no maybe not okay again a new beginning okay this is a beautiful new beginning a prosperity here 
I love it because you've got the two of pentacles you've got the ten of pentacles my gosh you got and now you've got the ace of pentacles so definitely prosperity whatever you're working towards probably in the financial part of your of your life right now you're going to be able to see you know uh, a reward for your hard work and effort this, that you're going to be able now to create the magic that you want to okay so you're going to be grounded here you're turning over a new leaf trust yourself trust and focus on what you can get the results the tangible results that you're going to get here and you're going to get them the gift of beautiful prosperity it's like you know uh you know it's prosperity and abundance coming in fantastic the eight of pentacles you've worked hard for it and you deserve it you've had to maintain your dignity your humility and your kindness and understanding here this is the strength card that says when you're communicating with anybody and even in challenging times and debating times okay step back look at the whole picture and go in with the gentleness of the lamb not the roar of the lion and i tell you this all the time do not go in and re and react and then later regret okay so take a breath step back and look at a situation here i think you've had to be patient here you you know you're working through something here towards your goals towards your finances towards uh you know whatever it is your career um know that you know you have to be a little more understanding and compassionate when you when you're dealing with with this situation but mainly if you're dealing with people the energy of people around you okay compassion understanding and sometimes forgiveness comes into this card now the tower rebuilding and look what happens nine of cups wishes fulfilled you made your wish and now it's going to happen so you're rebuilding a brand new foundation here that's going to lead you to this prosperity that you so desire fabulous for some of you you may see partnership and business or in love coming in home life happy harmony children money this is beautiful Ful wishes fulfilled you pretty much don't have to make a wish it's coming towards you ace of wands what have we got victory after hard work and struggle yeah this is a new beginning for you you've completed something and you've worked very hard towards something Capricorn you've accomplished something now you need to pat yourself on the back and realize you're going to get noticed for this some of you might be getting a degree a diploma recognition for what it is you've done this is an amazing amazing card so I think you know you're going to see prosperity you're going to get recognized for the hard work that you've applied uh, you know you've worked hard towards here it's a beautiful card of good luck good karma getting rewards okay this is the card of victory so you're going to be you know the center of attention here so get used to it my dear friends okay this is a beautiful card of you know victory victory after hard work and struggle and success wow capricorn this is an amazing reading some of you are going on a new journey you're going in a brand new direction something's ended here and you're moving on now coming in with our uh, you've got the two of swords on top of the eight of wands you're going to be getting busy now you're going to have to balance yourself here and see a picture in complete clarity but I think you will here okay because the ace of swords says you're going to see you're going to get that aha moment and see something come in in clarity you could have locked horns with somebody else here could have been in court could be a legal action you know you could have been waiting once the decisions made I think you're going to find that you're going to be very busy the delays are going to be over okay so take off the blindfolds look at the picture in complete clarity and then you're going to be able to make that decision and then you're going to be able to get busy wow well my beautiful Capricorns this is your reading for this week and I wish you a great remainder to today and again a beautiful optimistic week here to look forward to enjoy enjoy this new beginning a new journey that you're going into because the wheel of fortune says you're going to see it remember the universe and the divine your higher power want you to succeed and want you to find your happiness and peace it's as simple as that so surrender to it and move forward towards your goals and happiness blessings my beautiful souls and know that I always and only stand in this circle of love and light for you my prayers are that you stay safe play safe and be safe and I'll see you soon